Hey everybody, Galusia here, and today I'm going to be joined with Viper and Scale. They're on their way back to the craft right now. Oh, there they are, over the horizon? Is it a horizon? If it's... No, it's a little horizon, you're right, on the moon. Up the hill. Oh, 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 Ow. Okay. So I have a surprise for them, and then we have some errands to run. That's the, uh, the plan huh. today. Only one of you can get in at a time. Come on, you know the rules. Oh, man. Piper's head is in the that chair. So, first things first, uh, let me address the fact that my camera is not on screen, because for this entire series, you guys have been seeing me, and now I'm gone. Uh, I've moved my setup, and although I have a camera, and I could be on camera if I wanted to, I don't have a green screen and I don't have all that stuff set up and the reason for that is that I don't uh, I'm because the area that I'm in like it would be honestly just very complicated and a pain in the butt to have all that stuff set up so I just don't really want to deal with it right now plus the series that we have coming up Conan I was already planning on not having the camera on screen because that's not the kind of series that's gonna be and I didn't want to be on screen for that so uh, I figured we may as well just get used to it, so that's why my face is gone. Okay, you guys, this is the uh, surprise. Ready? Ow. Oh, you God. You guys, are, come over here. Come over here. Where are you at? Where are you? Come here. I don't know. Where are come you? Come over here. Boom, suckers! Six out of seven of the Tetras! Jesus hmm. I've been that's busy. At least 12. I've been yeah, busy. So uh, I got every single one of the geometric trip to check this, except for yeah, nice. the most difficult nice one, which is which is Astrox. Um, Glacio alone took me like six hours, probably. Jesus, Glacio <laughs> was not fun. So originally, the me and the guys were planning on this episode honestly being probably. The, the last one, but we weren't going to be getting to the end credits because it's such a Herculean task that, you know, we were uh, you know, we were just going to go to Astrox so that you guys could experience that planet because we haven't seen it yet, and then that was, that was more or less going to be what it was. It was like, alright, great, here it is, now let's, you know, thanks for watching everybody because, you know, we're trying to focus on Conan, we need to get that series going. But, um... Jesus. That, was, that loud. was loud. But I really wanted to... Uh, I really want to get to the end credits. So, for our last episode, that's my goal. But I really need your guys' help. Which means stop playing on recreational balls. We need to go... Now. We have to leave. Come on. Get in the damn ship. Uh, huh? Make sure make sure your, your back is empty. And you're ready to collect. You know, minus whatever you normally like having on you. But we need to get resources for building things and then we need to go to then we need to come back to here and then we need to go to Astrox and we have a lot to do we have a lot to do so get in the, the damn ship I'm getting stuff off my back I was told to do this yeah hurry up I'm hurrying we're gonna go to Glacio which means you guys can see the ridiculous setup that I had to build to unlock one of the teleportation things in Glacio that also happens oh. to be where the oxygenator is, so... Ow. Just click it once, scale. Yep, I, I keep double pressing it. Go! But there happens to be a lot of uh, both ammonium and uh, iron on Glacio, and that's what we need. So that's what we're going there to do. We're going there to collect that. Yay. Obviously, you know, you can use trade platforms and blah, 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 but... It'll be a lot faster just to go to Glacio, and that way both you and the viewers gets to see my ridiculous setup. So this is my base. I had to set up I had to set up this entire structure oh just to power God. this one beacon. <laughs> Look at how many wind turbines there are. <laughs> that is amazing. These are sea platforms as well. Oh my god. Yep. That's hilarious. Yeah, it takes a minimum of 26 wind turbines to power one of these things on Glacio. 
Just Glacio <laughs> does not play. Glacio is here. <sighs> is here for good. Oh, I need healing. Does this work? It does. All right. That is our new storage thing for the. <laughs> okay, have all the hydrogen in the world. <laughs> I'm out of helium, so we're gonna have to go to. We have to go to Astrox anyway. That doesn't work. Can you get that off of there, please? Are you sure that doesn't work? That it works. yeah, it's not gonna close with that on there. Are you sh positive? I. You know what? I don't care if it does or not. That looks ridiculous. Get it off my spacecraft. It looks hilarious. We're keeping it on. No, it looks like we the have most way ridiculous. More storage now. Get it out of there. It's on there. You can't stop it. <sighs> Skell, I have 20 minutes before I gotta go. I don't have time for this. You're over here making exactly. storages that we don't even need because we have plenty of storage. I'm trying to get out of here. We have to actually leave, like, right now. Yeah. I have to go to Astrox because I can't finish the project because we're out of helium. And there's helium on Astrox waiting for me. And then we have to oh. come back to finish what we're building. Like, there's a lot of running around we need to do. Mm -hmm. And I can't even make ends meet of stuff because, like, you got stuff all over the place. Okay. Uh, for Atrox, I'm not 100% sure that I have a beacon where I landed. So I think this is the landing site, but we may have to take off again because it's not. Because I don't think I ever set up a beacon. So just hang tight for a second until You're we confirm. Yeah, I am. Yes. Yeah, this doesn't look right. This doesn't look right at all. <laughs> Uh, hold on, let me get out really quick, just to make sure. Just don't, don't get out. Stay. Oh God, oh God, we're being shot at. Leave, leave. Get back, abort. Yeah, no, I don't, I don't see anything here. Okay, so that's not it. I mean, maybe I did put down it, but I'm pretty sure I forgot to bring a piece of quartz with me when I came to Atrox. So I'm pretty sure there's no thing. And I can't just set up a new base like I did on Kalidor. <laughs> I couldn't find the base on Kalidor. Like, I literally couldn't figure out where I landed. So I just made a whole new base when I, like, unlocked the planet. <laughs> I know it's relatively close to a beacon. And I know it's not, like, way on the edges. It's, like, on the equator somewhere. But it's also hard to see with all these fucking clouds. Like, where do I land? I know I wouldn't have clicked way on the edge. Like, I would be on the equator. At this point, I'm just going to click on every landing site on the equator until one of them's right. Scale. Uh, yeah? Can you see the landing sites? Because I can't. No, I cannot see a single landing site. Mm. Hey, think... there we go. Found it. Hey. Alright. Take off the, uh, the big thing. With pleasure. Hmm. Curious. I'm just gonna log. Log and rejoin. I I'll do that once we get back to Silva. Wait, wh why is there helium on here? On what the big thing? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I fucking hmm. knew it. I knew it. Scale. I hate you. You were over there playing with your stupid thing, making ridiculous storages, and I knew I wasn't out of helium, but all of a sudden, I couldn't make RTGs anymore, so I said, oh, I must have ran out of helium, I guess I need to go get more. Nope. You just moved it, so I didn't have access to it anymore. I knew I didn't run out of helium, because I brought back a few, and you only use one little sliver of the helium per manufacturing. I knew I had plenty. Well, at this point, I think all you Well, should, we got more anyways. All you could do is uh, just go ahead and load that stupid thing up and let's take it back. I'm not loading that stupid thing up. It's going to sit here. It's an abomination. It's not going in my spacecraft anymore. I can't do anything because i got to wait for scale to reload because he's glitching out on my screen. And I need to put then the... Then load up some helium. I can't. You're in the way. Your loading screen is, like, glitching into the spacecraft. I can't do anything. Interesting. And I don't want that abomination on the spacecraft. Besides the fact that it looks ridiculous, I think it's glitching <laughs> it out. So I don't want it on there. Well, so it's just going to sit here. It's a derelict. It's a derelict now. 
It's going to just sit right. there. But I need to wait for scale to get the hell out of the game. Okay. So we're going to just put these in here like normal people, including all the iron that we left on the thing for some reason. Scale, just put it, put it right there. Okay, that's fine. That's more helium than we'll ever need. Get back in the space crew. And at least this confirms I do have an RTG here, which I thought I did, but I wasn't a hundred. So. Are we taking that? No. Hmm. Okay. Uh, but we do need to try to remember where we are. So everyone, <laughs> make note because I still don't have a beacon. I have. I didn't see anything like any of the beacons coming in, so I have no fucking clue. There's one right there. Yeah, I have a little bit more of a frame of reference now, but... Oh, okay, I can see landing spots now. They still don't make sense to me. I guarantee I won't find it when we come back, but we'll make sure mm -hmm. to bring a beacon with us. So basically, we just... So I already have... Okay, so I have all the RTGs that we need. Uh, there was already a set of cable extenders there, and I added a couple so we would need to bring a few more cable extenders for sure um but other than that i think that's it i think we pretty much have everything we need um i don't want to have to come back i want to make sure that we get this right so the only thing that i can think of is cable extenders which i'm going to make right now Platforms and, we have. Yeah, enough. I built I built an extra large platform C to place the RTGs. The only thing I don't have that I want We're also gonna need is tethers for the mining. Uh, yes, that's a good point. We will need tethers. There's not a lot of resources on Atrox. Like, um, I mean, there's there's a fair amount of compound there. I mean, I'm sure we could make them there. It's but we could. Easier. Um, it's just easier we have to. All the compound we need. Yeah, it's easier to just manufacture them here. So I'll grab. I'll do that really quick too. Why is my? Oh my god! I just accidentally sucked up. F <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. I was like, "Why am I so bright?" I was trying to make cable extenders, and I made three work lights. <laughs> I was like, "Why did it get so bright? Like I can't even see it so bright right now." I just wasted like almost all of it on that like we literally like i'm gonna have to use up the only copper we have left now to make what i was actually trying to make <laughs> well done yeah thank you i wasn't paying attention i was just waiting for my backpack to like suck up the car the copper and then i was like okay and then i just started hitting build and wasn't paying attention to what it was building like i somehow <laughs> managed to make three work lights i'm an idiot nice yeah good times good times uh okay well um i think we're ready to go so we'll uh probably to the viewers like you guys won't know it'll be a second but i'm gonna relog the game so that we can kind of work out some of these glitches because i think the game got a little bit confused i think we screwed with it a little bit so i'm gonna shut off the game we'll come back in and then we'll we'll finish up and then we're gonna be heroes we're going to be end credit heroes. Okay, so here's what we need to do. Uh, we have to set up all the RTGs in the available slots that I've made. I could have brought um, large storages to put that onto, but it wasn't really necessary. Actually, here, let's use the abomination. Take all the stupid shit off of it and then just put the RTGs on it. See, it's useful for something. Good we didn't job. even have to bring the big C. Good job. No, we didn't have to, well, probably, but um, I just like the way it looks. It is going to look interesting with all those RTGs on it. Power bank. Yeah. Okay, and then there's more on here. 
Oh, you know what? I was going to make more batteries, too, because there's literally only one battery here. But I Oh, all the extenders? I'll get to work on the extenders, I suppose. Yeah, I mean, you can see what direction you have to go in. It's going to take a while. It's certainly a team effort. Um, mm -hmm. We have a long way to go to extend these cables out to it. But I really didn't want to build it. I didn't want to build the power. I didn't want to build the power at the place. Like, I really these wanted to like, like, have it These aren't, like, proper here. distances, so do it yourself because it's it's really annoying to use the exchanges because you have to have the backpack yeah. open and then yeah, press yeah. f to drop it so you have to go like just super slow you set them where you want them to go and i'll plug them up yeah we we can adjust them like yeah, that one i'm a just bit walking yeah. towards it there you go yeah i'll i'll get the cable you stretch out it all the way out and and yeah it. yeah it's just so we don't drop them in all in one place and then have to fucking walk back and forth to pick them up mm -hmm. we do not have enough extenders Really? Yeah. Wow, I brought a lot. Because I'm already on the last one. Really? Yeah, they do not go far or have many. No. Look how much well, farther over we have there. Go. Well, over there, they're a lot closer together. So hopefully, I mean, we'll be able to stretch these out. Mm -hmm. So if it's not enough, uh, which it doesn't look like it will be, nope, then what we're going to have to do is... Um, uh, this that's it's not ideal, but we're gonna have to go to Calador because that's the easiest place to get copper, and so that we can make a lot more. We should have Which, a bunch of copper at the base. We don't. I used all of it. Oh, okay, never mind then. I even got like an additional piece of copper before leaving, and made extenders out of that. But remember, I made like three work lights by accident. <laughs> oh my shit! It's so bright. <laughs> And these are stretched out just about as far as they can go. Like the two man oh, team. Wait, no, never mind. There's there's a lot more extenders here. Oh, okay, already. good. That's <laughs> that's Relief sets in. Yeah, that's yeah. great news. Is that it? That no, 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 no. I was just checking something really quick. Oh, <laughs> you know what's you know what's funny? I remember uh, towards the start of this series. Uh oh. Uh, I remember since it was the start of the series, Glue, you made fun of Scale for his ridiculous yeah, daisy chain right. that he did. For, and now look what we're doing here. Well, at least we're daisy chaining extenders. It's an intended purpose. <laughs> uh, is that yeah, Holy crap, what the deuce? Well, I mean, I was using extenders, I just didn't have enough. No, you were using a bunch of, like, solar panels and wind turbines. Yeah, because we didn't have any copper for the extenders. And I got us power, all right? <laughs> you know what I like? I like that, like, Viper, are you, um... I know, you, like, you live in, like, the south now, but that's where you were originally from, right? I mean, I am living where I'm originally from. Okay. Scale, did you not have any tethers? Because there's no airlines. Uh, I, I just anymore. I dropped them because I needed space for these. Oh Can well, I saw those. Oh, no, I'll go pick them up if you. Oh, I, I have I have ex I have extenders on my back. I have a, oh, I still have a set. Give me, drop them. Well, I have to go back and get the air. You. How many needs? Okay. There you go. Oh, fuck. I still think it's not gonna be enough. No, I don't think it is either. But we're really close. So, like I said, we can make a quick trip to Calador. And find some copper, because there's bountiful amounts of it there. Oh, I'm in a hole. Uh, but I like that uh, Viper's from the south. I'm from the east coast. And then uh, the great war Scale is from uh, the, north. the north. Yeah, so from Canada, <laughs> specifically. So, oh, God. Okay, that happened, apparently. Hold on, let me run these tether lines really quick. <laughs> but, yeah, I so... Wish... And then when... Um, so Kim, when Kim joins us, she'll be – she's from the East Coast too, but she's from North Carolina. So that's a little bit, you know, different than, like, where I'm from, like, the Northeast. Like, because that's, like – that's East Coast, but it's, like, South East Coast. Like, there's still rednecks there. But then the <laughs> – um, Actually, God, this is going to be really close, isn't it? You know, like – I, I think feel like we're fine, gonna like these are pretty close together. You know, like we're gonna just miss it. I just want to let you know before uh, it gets out of hand that I'm not too south south because I'm Kentucky, all right. 
Yeah, but Kentucky's the South, bro. Come on. It ain't that <laughs> south. It ain't that south. Hold on, I'm gonna. Have you heard yourself? That. That's pretty south. Have you, have you heard you yourself? yourself? <laughs> <laughs> but no, it's not like I mean, he doesn't have like a huge yeah, southern no, it's, twang it's in his voice south. or something. What the fuck? But it's I the, you but your sayings, it's like you have like sayings that like I would not ever like I wouldn't know like because like every area has its own idioms. Uh, mm -hmm. right, fair enough. I wish you all could see the, sh the ridiculousness of this. Thing. Like sometimes they I'm, like I'm kick back on themselves. Yep, I'm seeing what you're saying. It's like but looping the fucking. So close. Okay, I'll go get some platforms. We're not leaving this place. Oh, yeah, no. Uh, this is... Just get platforms for this. We're so close. Someone else should come grab one with me. Oh, yeah. God. Actually, we don't yeah. even have to grab platforms. We just have to grab some uh, wind turbines. Glue, do you see what's on the other side of this thing? No, I haven't. Oh, oh yeah. If we haven't, I think I stand, have a couple small ones. Stand where I'm standing. I ran back to get a platform. I'm not there now. Oh. You gotta, see, you gotta see this. He's like, aww. <laughs> so, this beacon requires 30 units of power. So, it's obviously the most demanding of any of them. And it is being powered purely with RTGs. So, I feel like this is, so. we are severely end game right now. Mm -hmm. If we bring back that big platform, we can just bring all the RTGs with us. Whatever planet we need. Oh, that's true. There we go. That's actually a good point, Scale. We can use that platform now to, like, literally just, like, power Bring, any of these yeah. things anywhere as long as we can we fly close enough to it. Yeah. Okay, so where's this huge hole? Oh, God. Just right. on, yeah. Yeah. That is a huge hole. <laughs> okay, Let's well. Let's go down. This side. Yeah. This looks yeah. like a fairly gradual thing. I was going to say, I can use this as a starting point to oh, build sweet. a ramp. Stop, stop, stop. I, I, I want some of this compound down here. Ow. Well, yeah, get the, that's fine. I but. dig so fast, if I dig below myself, I'll just end up killing you. I have a, a level three, um... I have uh, a level two and head. a boost mod, and a wide mod. Yeah, I don't use any other mods but the drill, but it's a level three, so it'll go through any surface. I needed that for Glacio, because the, the rock gets so solid that yeah. it, okay i'm out of dirt i got gotcha. you thank you i also found that as you go down because of the curvature of the planet you can't just use a smooth ramp like you have to like yeah. redefine you can the use edge it for the uh for a while but then eventually it just gets too shallow and you're not it gets shallow it. yeah you have to keep turning it we're charging our batteries really slow which is odd considering this is oh my god i know oh, why i know i know why as well we never hooked up the, the base. oxygenator to, to the, the base. We're charging off no of the shuttle. Power. There's no there's no power in the shuttle. The shuttle just has like a static, very low amount of power. So uh, we yeah. need to. I, I'll be right back. I'll fix it. That's dumb mistake on our part. I was gonna say like we should like even with both of us digging at the same time, like we yeah. shouldn't with be having RTGs, this kind of an issue. No problem. Yeah, the RTGs uh, should be powering us. No problem. We have. Uh, eight of them, so that's 32 units of power, and we're not using any power at the base whatsoever, so. Oh my god, almost fell in a chasm. Why is that gaping hole still open? Let's close that. Good god. That is a hazard. Okay, OSHA is gonna be on our ass. <laughs> uh -oh. Oh! oh my god. <laughs> I ran out of dirt as I was sliding down. Mm. I ran out of dirt real quick. I guess it's gonna be canister. Normally I have like two. Oh. How many tethers you got still? Quite a bit. Nope. Oh. I'm out of power. Whoa. Yeah, I need to stand here for a little yeah, bit. Yeah, I need to charge up. Yeah, you're Why not gonna Why am I charging so slow? Probably because we're a long ways away from the. Do you uh, think that matters? Like the length of it, like reduces it. I mean, that's realistic. Like there is a loss over, uh, a loss over oh, line. Please. Like in real life, like power lines lose power as they go. Like there's a bleed off, and they have to calculate for that when they're like setting their lengths and stuff. 
Let's walk around on this surface cave level for a little bit, see if we can find some compound, because... But just be weary, because everything down here wants to kill us, and it's and there's dangerous things everywhere. I'm gonna stay nearby the ramp, uh, in case you guys, like, need emergency air. Okay. Also, I'll act as a beacon. To as a beacon. The... Yeah, I appreciate the beacon. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh god, I'm not even sliding. I'm just falling. <laughs> Free falling! God, there's a lot of things trying to kill me right now. Okay. God, there's so much of it. Whoa! That is like the mother. I've never, never have I seen a stronium like this. See, when they actually create the end game material, like, if and when they do, and, like, Astronium has a purpose, like, this is where you come to get it, obviously, like, which, again, makes sense, because Astrox, Atrox is the most challenging planet, so it should have more of this stuff, but there's so much of it that we're tripping over it. I finally made it, that entire time I was just traveling up, I finally just made it back to the surface. Nice. <laughs> That's how long we've been away from this. Oh, this is dense. <laughs> yeah, they I'm wanted to make sure that you had to make a level three to come down here, because this is super dense. This is the slowest I've dug in anything in a while. All right, then. Hmm. Go research, er, uh, delay type. Yeah, this Ooh. is, uh... This is my first time seeing this. Oh, that's right. This mm -hmm. is your first time in a planet core. Yeah, super sketchy. Oh, this was oh. uh, another connector. Weird. Whoa. Well, good. Then you get to do the honors. When you get in here... Ah, um, they're gone! There is oxygen, but there is no power, so just be aware of that. But then just bring the here. helium to the, the center. It's a Viper. Ah! Oh, God! What the is fuck is walking up, one of the, walking up one of the wall. He's on the ceiling. Oh. Where is he? Uh, yeah, is come he down right here, side? buddy. You gotta walk oh. up one of the walls. <laughs> down here? I'm like, yo, you're above me. You're on the <laughs> ceiling. We're on the floor. What the fuck? I didn't know that. <laughs> okay, so put the helium into one of these things. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> I swear to God, it said. I looked that, it up. It, that looks like helium, but it's not. It's missing one of the. Uh, one of the orbs. It's missing one of the uh, electrons, I suppose. Because hmm. there's one, two, but the helium. Yeah, look at the look at the uh, icon for helium. There's it's missing one right there. So it's not helium. That's all right. Look at me. Ah. Here, here we go. Don't miss it, skill. Yay! It worked. Mine. Wow. Okay, do that. Right, make another. Now we need another one. You don't have to go to a different thing. You can use. The I same just one. felt like it. Yeah. Oh. Uh. Oh, there it is. Hold up. Okay. How did you manage that? I, was I don't say. know. I put, listen, I put it down, and then it, for some <laughs> reason, it just thought it just disappeared. <laughs> to the other side. Nice. Hey. Dibs. <laughs> uh, the only one it? that's active? No, I know, but I can't see it from this side, and it won't let me rotate it because it's dumb. I can't see an active one. All right. We are off to the satellite, yo. Yay. We're going to beat this game because there's an actual ending now. Yay. <laughs> okay. I see it. Uh, why won't it let me fly to it? Don't we have to teleport there from one of the things? Mm, well, oh God, I don't know where I'm flying to right now because I just randomly clicked. We into the sun. Are we going to it? Where? I oh no! Yeah, there's a satellite. View. I clicked on oh, the satellite. Oh, that is it. Yeah. Okay. Cool. I told oh, you because yeah, it's it not showing me. Like it's not. Let, it's it's being weird. I I'm just clicking on things and hoping that I land somewhere. <laughs> 
Okay. Just clean the water over. Well, this is okay, this cool. Is straightforward. Indeed. There's quite a few landing platforms. There there are quite a few landing we platforms. We forgot to bring the oxygenator. Ow. There's a wall there. Also, apparently, I'm glitched. Sweet. Oh. Like, okay, you can't get out? Happened. Yeah. Well, log in and log back in, because I don't want to finish yeah. this without you. Uh, I think it's this one? Nothing's you know moving what? on my screen. Yeah, there's spinning, there's spinning arches of light. Arches along these, along these purple things. Nah, I've seen, I'm seeing nothing. And another one. Um, this one? Oh no, I've been gypped, I can't point. This one. And this one. Um, oh, it doesn't sound good. Oh, oh god. god! Okay, yeah, here we go. Woo! Hey, look at all that stuff on my backpack. Cutscene! Uh, purple. Hey. Oh. And beyond. Oh. Oh, okay. Go, spaceship. Into the great unknown. Interesting. Uh-oh. Uh A rift, huh? Ooh. Are we going to go the inside the rift? Of course. Do we go inside the in the rift and go beyond, or do we go home? Ooh. We go beyond. Let's do it. Fum. Something inside the spaceship. Oh, a, a burrito. <laughs> Disconnect to a space bar. astronaut. <laughs> we make a new one. We will make another. Well, that just kind of goes to show that they make right. the astroneers. Yep. Hey, cool. roll credits. Yay. Oh, well, that was a lot of hard work. Uh, I appreciate your guys' help. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm glad that we were able to accomplish this. Uh, I apologize that I ended up doing a lot of it without you guys, just to make sure that we could get to this day. I, oh, yeah. I just forever. marathon played this game for like a week. But uh, I, I do still think that we need to do a live stream where we try to get from start to finish in a single, like, ridiculous marathon stream. Lord of mercy. Um, but, yeah, <laughs> that was a lot of fun. And this this whole series has been a lot of fun. I'm going to say, before, like, without, like, just so for those of you that don't know, like, the both this and the Forest series are going to be reviewed, and those reviews are coming up. I think by the time this episode airs, the Forest review will actually already be posted on the channel, and then now the Astroneer review will be coming up shortly after that. But um, before I actually like render the reviews of the games, because uh, I actually don't know how the scores are going to play out. I know what the score is for the forest already, but I, I haven't scored this game yet. So as far as scores, I don't know which one is better. But in terms of fun, this game is better. Like I will say yeah. that I, I enjoyed my time on this game with my friends oh, nice. more than I did in the forest. Like both games are fun and I had a good time playing both of them. And honestly, I, I really don't know how it's gonna score out. So it may be that like in terms of sheer scoring, the forest is technically a better survival game, but uh, Astroneer was a lot of fun. I really appreciate the challenge and I really appreciate the diversity. Oh, oh. oh. well that's nice of them, except go. I'm alive. Uh, <laughs> and, and I was born in 84. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we want to thank friends, oh, colleagues, oh. mentors, astroneer fans, and everyone who changed. Oh, I didn't even get to finish reading it. I didn't even notice oh. there was something on the screen. Oh god, what's happening? Oh, oh, I, oh, I can see the core. Okay. I can see everyone back. Yeah. Now we're just okay. Oh, jeez. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, hey, they put us here. I was gonna say. Uh, downside is. 
We don't have our, our spaceship. spaceship. <laughs> it's on the thing. That's... Well, we have we have the small one. I know. So like, we well, obviously we can take one of the small ones to get there, but that's a ripoff. Okay. Well, anyway, cool. So um, that's it. We beat the game, and then it spit us back out here. So here we are. So obviously we can continue to play the game if we wanted to, and I would to a point. I would challenge myself to unlock all of the teleportation cores and uh, like the platforms throughout the planets. And I've always wanted to build like a very large mega base that was like really organized because we kind of like threw this together as we went to like, you know, for our needs. Yeah. I would like to start with a fresh base, like set down a saddle, uh, a, uh, a cellar, shelter, shelter, a shelter. And then, yep. like, around the shelter, like, design a very purposeful base that looks really cool. Um, but, uh -oh. uh, but not today, obviously. Today, perfect. Today, <laughs> uh, we are done. So, again, thanks, everybody, for watching. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe as well as hit that bell icon so that you know when new videos are coming up. And then keep an eye out for Conan because Conan will be starting here shortly. Um we're going to be adding another cast member, and we uh, are obviously going to, you know, it's a completely different game from Astroneer, and uh, I'm really looking forward to the different experience, and Conan's a very extensive game, so I imagine that's something that can take a while, um, but we're also going to do a couple one-offs and stuff like that to, um, you know, mix it up. Huh. Yay! So, thanks again, everybody. I appreciate it. Hopefully, you all love the Astroneer series as much as we love playing it. And we will see you next time. Bye. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> How did we synchronize that? Yes! What? And the ball scored. Okay. Again, so. Yeah, the crazy.